Country Music's A-List descended on Nashville for the 2017 CMT Awards Wednesday night with the ceremony hosted by Charles Esten from the hit TV show Nashville. Now in case you missed the show or you just want to relive the night in all its southern glory, hold tight to your cowboy hat as we recap some of the evening's most memorable moments. In honor of the late great Greg Allman, whose passing on May 27th shocked the country music world, Lady Antebellum's Charles Kelly, Jason Aldean, and Darius Rucker paid homage to the icon, performing the Allman Brothers' 1971 classic, Midnight Rider. I'm not gonna Bathed in a rosy glow and wearing a shiny silver jacket over a little black dress, Miranda Lambert, who was nominated for two CMT awards for both Video of the Year and Female Video of the Year for Vice, turned up the tood for her latest single, Pink Sunglasses, playfully rolling her eyes and sing rapping the feisty lyrics throughout. She even got the crowd in on the action by passing out the pink shades to everyone. Speaking of Miranda, her ex Blake Shelton dialed things down, crooning his newest ballad, Every Time I Hear That Song, off his 2016 album, If I'm Honest, with the single currently at number 12 on Billboard's Hot Country Songs chart. Now, it was certainly a night of crossover mega collabs with duo Video of the Year winners for Holy, Florida Georgia Line, and EDM pop hitmakers, the Chainsmokers, playing on the rooftop deck of Nashville's newest hotspot, the FGL House, for a firework filled performance of the foursome single, Last Day Alive. Taking home the award for CMT Performance of the Year for the rendition of Jason Derulo's Want to Want Me at CMT Crossroads, Luke Bryan and Derulo hit the stage to duet the track all over again, equipped with smoke cannons and Jason's signature high notes. Now, the night's most nominated country star and biggest winner, Keith Urban, took home four awards, including Video of the Year and Male Video of the Year for Blue Ain't Your Color, as well as Collaborative Video of the Year for The Fighter, alongside duet partner Carrie Underwood. The duo took a different approach to the love anthem, starting out slow to emphasize the lyrics, while building up to tempo of the original record. Carrie also nabbed the Female Video of the Year trophy for Church Bells. Now, not all the evening's love songs were as whimsical. Group Video of the Year winners Little Big Town performed their heartbreaking ballad, When Someone Stops Loving You. You know what? I can totally relate. All right, now we have to talk about Kelsey Ballerini, one of my favorites, who not only premiered her new single, Legends, at this year's CMTs, but she also performed it outside, while barefoot. You know you've made it when you don't have to wear shoes anymore. The 23-year-old singer belted out her new track while surrounded by a slew of adoring fans, giving them a taste of her highly anticipated album. And finally, closing out the 2017 CMT's country trio Lady Antebellum sang their hit You Look Good from their soon-to-be-dropped album Heartbreak, just before their unlikely pairing with R&B legends Earth, Wind & Fire. Things really kicked into party mode when Earth, Wind & Fire busted out the irresistible September, with Lady A handling some of the verses on the iconic 1978 disco soul classic. Do you remember? Oh, and one last thing, I have to give a big shout out to our girl Lauren Elena, who took home Breakthrough Video of the Year for Road Less Traveled. Whew, all right, you guys, this cowgirl is exhausted. But for complete coverage of the CMT Awards, head to billboard.com. Till next time, I'm Chelsea Briggs. Bye, y'all.